Hey guys, welcome to, uh, I guess our first official video here. This is Eric Murphy, um, one of the two brothers here running the channel. Um, so Murphy, uh, fam, I guess. So that's what our new uh, little family will be called here on the channel. Uh, for all you guys watching, welcome. Now we don't have James Murphy with us right now, but I just wanted to like shoot a little video here for the channel. I know it's been a while, so since like we've even made the channel, and for everyone watching this, thank you. Thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch these videos. Um, we're gonna be doing a couple different things. We're gonna be doing Minecraft, uh, probably. Um, I'm thinking obviously farming simulator and that's probably going to be all for what we'll be doing there'll be videos like this where we're just by ourselves and there'll also be videos when we're with others as well so i actually just want to give you guys a little tour of the farm and i mean what we own we actually got our job today we're going to be picking up a farm or a project truck so here's a little quick this isn't going to be like a long video as well but this is pretty much the personal farm or it's just going to be me uh, James actually has his own as well, so he might be recording a little bit of that. Um, but yeah, pretty much we own this whole field here. That's our good buddy over there. We'll call him. Actually, that's James over there. That's my brother that actually owns that, even though obviously this is my own game. You know, that's we're just going off that for now. Um, we own the silo system. Yes, it's kind of the loading systems put into the street, but it's actually really useful. Um, we got. I actually bought this for about 16 grand. It's a 1979 K30. We got this 2017 uh, long bed trailer. Um, we got this barn. We got this one. We own this field right here. There's a field right beside this one right here, field two, which is field one right there. We own that one as well. We only own three fields currently. Um, eventually planning on maybe buying this one right behind field two don't know yet got a this one might not be staying it might be leaving soon it's a 2008 gmc sierra uh dually 3500 duramax has a plow on it all that good stuff um i actually this is one of my recent purchases i bought it uh early winter just before the snow came so that was a nice little add-on we'll go into this barn here um we have a 4755, really nice tractor. One of my personal favorites. Um, it has a little weight on it. I haven't actually driven it at all, so we just have that. Came with the farm. Same as this, the New Holland Skid Steer. I'm debating about keeping it. I also kind of want to go to a, either a Kubota tracked one or a Bobcat, so that might be in the works. Either way, I'll be keeping this front pallet jack. Um, we got a fertilizer. We also got a Fent combine. We also got actually a Massey Ferguson in James's storage over there. It was nice to let, nice enough to let us store it over there. This folds out, as you can probably tell. Um, I'm not too good with the header names, so I don't really know what that one's called. Um, we got a disker. I'm probably going to sell this for a cultivator. It's a disker and cedar. I don't know. I might end up keeping it. Or we actually got another cedar over in this barn right here which we'll get to in a sec it's not as big but we'll probably end up s selling that and either keeping this or just sell both um rock picker obviously i've used it a couple times as you can see i plan on keeping it for now probably won't use it really at all but i mean i just was going through field two and using that but i also got another attachment for the skid steer i want to get a bucket um that's all for this barn now we also got a header over here, which I'll probably end up selling because we're going to be doing corn. We got a, uh, I'm not too good on the year of this truck. I'm going to say early 90s, Mac Semi with the uh, 2010 grain trailer on the back. It's not too big. We'll probably end up upgrading. Also, I should have told you guys, we also have a washer over here, and I still have yet to figure this thing out. I have no clue what that is. Pretty sure it's for the field, so. Um, let me know if you know any of what this stuff is as well, like the header name and, you know, the thing I just showed you down there. Um, we got this, uh, little, um, cedar. This is the one actually I was just talking about. I'm probably going to end up selling it. I'm going to check if it has any seeds in it. If so, I'm going to use the seed or take it out. 
and if not we'll just end up selling it taking it to the dealership this trailer is probably going to end up being sold here's our seed i bought this about last season um just before harvest actually and i bought this around the same time just after harvest actually so i wanted to get prepared um the fertilizer as well we do own might end up selling it and just buy a leasing a cheaper one don't know yet we also have this tractor which actually has not moved once so um got plans for this one probably will end up keeping it same as the 4755 one might end up leave leaving i do like massey ferguson but i kind of like john deere more i just know it more so i might end up keeping it let me know in the comments which i should keep um here's my 20 or 2006 uh ford power stroke it's an f350 it's a 60 obviously um ranch hand bumper this is truly a work truck but i don't i take this is probably the work truck i take the most care about um we got the winch on the front of it I truly put it on this trailer just to get it out of the elements. I figured protect them both, protect as much as I could. Um, that's why we're still jammed in here. We're only in March, so I'll probably end up pulling this out probably soon. I don't know. It depends on if I just use that old K30 over there. Also, I think I'm going to just do a tour today, guys. I think I'm just going to do the tour today of the farm, kind of show you guys around, and then we'll get the truck next episode. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, like I said, we do want... So, I actually want to show you guys actually the field over there that we do own. Just going to unconnect this thing. Um, we're probably going to have to pull out the 6.0 because it's more of my pulling rig. So, we'll use that. This is mostly one that truly goes to the fields, obviously. Actually, we got... I completely forgot to show you guys this, even though he's doing a terrible job. But... We got a worker over here. This is a two thousand or a ninety or not ninety. Sorry, it's a seventy four, I believe, something around that. Um, you know the forty five hundred and fifty five hundred trucks. So it's one of those. It's like the semi version, but it's been converted into a tractor, and that's pretty much what that person is doing using right now. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much that. Like I said, we do own field two, this field right here. Oh god. Wicked driver. And yes, this is Richard's actually Richard Ohio. Uh Rich Man Ohio. Um And yeah, we got a couple they actually have realistic vid vehicles in this. They have the Ram thirty five hundred, the hay truck, this is on console as well, so console and PC, so it's all platforms. We own this field right here, and we own this one. They're both field one. I might end up plowing this road out eventually. I don't know. I might just keep it. This is another farm. I don't know. If I can buy it eventually, I might just end up buying it. But uh, I don't know. It might be kind of cool to have a couple chickens. But, uh, yeah, I think that's going to be all for today's episode. We might actually just buy that one like right across the street there with the silos, which isn't bad. But... Uh, Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I know it was a super exciting video. This guy will probably be working when you see the next video because I'm going to literally film it right now. But I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. We'll talk to you guys later. Peace.